Hi, this is Joni. Um, I have my last and final St. Patrick's Day layout um, for March of 2017. This is in my classic Happy Planner. And I kind of did this one quick. I just used up my sheet of stickers, uh, made a shaker pocket and with two pots of gold. Over here, I have a um, St. Patrick's Day carnation that I'm using just for decorative purposes for this video. It's um, it's one of these, you know, you can clip it on um, if you want to wear that like as a corsage tomorrow. I'm um, not tomorrow on St. Patrick's Day, so. Um, what else do I have? I use this really inexpensive washi that I I got with like washi I ordered for my granddaughter that she's not using. And it has little shamrocks on it and it has words in red that you can't even hardly make out. But it says um, footsteps of spring. I'm not really crazy about it, but I thought I'd use it up. Um, and so I got my um, rainbow. I like that, the golden um, shamrocks. And I've got all my little leprechauns dancing around. And um, my numbers. This is an undated Happy Planner, which I kind of like and don't like um, at the same time. Um, because they're because they're not dated I can kind of you know use them whenever I want so if I fall behind I can the pages are still good you know so I kind of sometimes use this like if I have a planner idea and I want to practice something new in I can do it in this happy planner you know because it's undated and I have plenty of extra pages this was the first one that I bought and as you can see, um, it gets, well, let me, let me start by taking the shamrock out, but, um, this is it since Christmas. I mean, that's pretty thick. So, um, I love this happy planner. It was the first one I got. I got it, I want to say, in August. Um, oh, I can't tell because I thinned it out. I got it in August, and um, it was my very first one. I have the big rings on it. Um, but in the new year, I moved on to a um, big, happy planner. So um, I love the covers on this one. I just, I love everything about this one. But... Um, I have to say, I do like the Big Happy Planner better. There's just more room for creativity. Um, it's just, I don't know, I like it better, the bigger one. Um, you can use any size stickers in the other one. You can't use the, well, you could use the Big Happy Planner stickers in this one. But, um, I don't know, I just think like the big one, the, the colors on the page pop because everything's bigger. So, um, but, um, this was my introduction to the Happy Planner, so, um, I still have it, I still use it, um, if I have, you know, I thought, you know what, I have a bunch of, um, stickers, um, they were duplicates, so I thought, let me make one more, you know, I, I find it fun planning, so I made one more spread, and, um, and now I'm done. I'm all caught up. And um, I might be on later. I'm in the middle of making a, a Easter wreath. So I might be on later to um, show you guys that because it's almost done. But um, thanks for watching. And if um, you're subscribed, thank you so much. And if you're not, hit the subscribe button and join the group. We have a nice group of gals that... Um, participate in my channel and um, let's share ideas. Thank you. Good night.